Welcome back everyone to another 3 by 3 shutter video. So you might be wondering why I upload the same door two days in a row. And the reason is that basically right after I finished recording yesterday's video, I redid the top and made it so it works in versions 1.11 to 1.16. Which was quite unfortunate. But I wanted to show this to you anyways, because I think it's nice. And also there are some people who are still playing older versions like 1.12 for performance reasons. And if we actually go into 1.11, we can see that it works, just like this. And of course it also works in 1.16, which I'm in right now. So yeah, let's just show you how to make this. All right, so you will need these materials and we'll start off by placing in the door frame, which again, will be right in the center of this three by nine area. And then a two block gap below. So I'll just fill this in. And for the layout, we have our singles on each side, like this. And then our folded double extenders, like so. The last one on this side. And then our normal double on top, like this. And again, we start off by connecting the singles. So place your input block right here and place blocks like this and then slabs like this into a block then a block here a slab below and the rail on top then you come to this side and place another three blocks like this two slabs a movable block any other block and an observer we just place dust on top of everything like this and the singles are done so for the double extenders the bottom is basically the same so two blocks a hopper and dust and then three observers then here we replace this with an observer place another two like this into a block on top we just place two more observers like this and for this one, you place observers like this. All right, so to finish the doubles, place two blocks like this. And then I repeat on three ticks here. Then I repeat on one tick here. Into a piston, into an observer pointing to the left. Just replace this. And for this one, two blocks, repeater and the dust. Two more blocks, a two tick repeater the slab and the rail to update this one okay so um now for this one we come down here place our one tick and our three tick and the torch and we place this circular shape two tick in the middle pointing to the left and then just two pieces of dust here and here and place this block and while we are down here, we can also place the block in a slab like this. With dust on the, on the slab. And a one tick on the block. Okay, so... Now we come up here and place a slab. And before we do anything else, I suggest you just replace these two blocks with something immovable. Because we need to place dust on top of this. And here. And we also need to place a 3D repeater like this. And now we can just replace it again. Place a hopper here and an observer. Okay, so that should almost be the um, folded extenders. So we can move on to the middle extender. So place a block here and a 3D repeater here. Piston and another block. Then a comparator and furnace like this. And now all that's left is the zero tick gen on top, basically. So we extend this line here with two slabs into a block and dust on top. Then place a hopper here, which will get powered and will be detected by this observer. And to create the zero tick, we place a sticky piston here, a normal piston like this, and a block here. Place two blocks like this, three rails, which will be powered by these blocks. 
and an observer which will detect that and to update this piston right here we place an observer like this and a 3D repeater on top now we place two blocks here with a repeater like this and now all we need to do is update this piston so you place a piston right here and then an observer like this and what this will do is on the closing this will extend and pass this line which will change the signal strength here which pass these observers which will update the piston and the opening this will attract but because this is a slab this doesn't do anything so yeah let's just fill this in and give it a test and it works so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video even though it's basically the same door as yesterday's video but yeah thank you for watching